Hi everybody, just a super quick update about the vanilla DAISY update 1.13 XML files. Well, the files for the game in general. I do one of these every time there's an update. So, if you want the vanilla files and you uh, haven't got a, a PC where you um, subscribe to DAISY server, which also gives it to you, the best place to get the files from is Bohemia Interactive's GitHub and they have just put 1.13 live so I'll put a link to it in the description the description <laughs> below the video um, and it'll take you to this page here and on this page what you're looking for is this box here that says code you click on it and you say download zip and that will download everything um, and then what you what you'll do is you then unzip that somewhere on your computer and you'll have um, this generous uh, let's go back uh, and there's Livonia so you've got all the events types um, CFGs everything everything is there so this is very very useful when it comes to creating your own modded XMLs because of course you can then introduce your mods to these XMLs now you may well be saying well Rob Rub, 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 rub. Surely I can just take my old XMLs or even mine, you know, the ones I do, the 1.12 XMLs, and just add in the M16, add in the new knife. Sure, you can do that, and that is a very quick way of doing it. However, what you went, what you won't get then is all the other um, balances and changes that the DayZ team have introduced with this patch. So. The longer way of going about it, the way I go about it, is that I download the Bohemia Interactive's vanilla 1.13 files and I start again. I start again. I make a list of everything I want to be in these modded files, you know, vehicles with stuff in, items spawn in, pristine, mags are full, all that sort of stuff. And then I slowly work my way through it, obviously copying and pasting in stuff from my previous XMLs, so that I get... Um, the benefit of the new XMLs with the new balancing and the benefit of my um, my additions as well. Now that is a longer way of doing it, um, of course. And the other thing I'd say as well is it's very important to remember that the developers at uh, Bohemian Interactive and at Daisy they are human, so these files will have errors in them. <laughs> okay, so just be aware of that as well if things don't work. Anyway, that's enough for me. I'll put a link to this in the description below the video. If you found the video useful, hit like if you want to see more the same, press subscribe, and I will of course see you again soon.